so welcome to a weekend in Paris vlog. It's Friday morning and I'm going to go film a project for work, so come along. sushi for a lunch and we're going to get drinks in the evening and then hopefully we go to Maxime's to club okay it's around four o'clock Paris is being very rainy um, but I'm done with all the work for today we had a really great show in the morning and then a meeting with the team uh, now I'm actually gonna go to Starbucks to upload last week's video on their Wi-Fi just sit there a bit and then I'm gonna go home I need to wash my hair um, and get ready for tonight we're going to a bar called La Perla first and then maybe clubbing at the Y'all are not fucking ready for my outfit. All right, I'm wearing this like floofy. I'm wearing this floofy little pink glitter dress, my cowboy boots, my cowboy hat. Like, I'm sorry, Barbie who? I'm literally fucking obsessed with myself. <laughs> oh. were so cool we went to Kong which is like a very New York vibes uh, cocktail bar and then we went to George's which is a lot of, like sketch in London so really really cool um, I fucking loved it anyway it's like 12 in the morning now um, I am ready so I'm wearing this green thrifted shirt George Avenue pants classic loafers we're gonna get hungover oysters so we're going I'm not actually hungover but the premise is there. So we're going to this place in the Marais, um, which does bottomless, all you can eat oysters for 36 euros. So let's go. Lunch was amazing. Um, we didn't we didn't get to do the all you can eat oysters because that's only with reservation. But I'm gonna put the name of the restaurant down below. Do all you can eat, 42 euros every Sunday, Thursday, and Friday, I believe. So if you're in Paris and you want to reserve that, they do. All you can eat up to four dozens per person. So go test your limits. I sadly won't be able to anymore. Uh, 
Let's check it out. The restaurant was amazing. Really happy we went. Um, I'm just walking home now. Paris is very rainy today. It's literally like raining on me, but I am still loving it. Like I'm still wheezing with joy inside. And if I like a city in the rain, it really means I like a city. <laughs> I just read on the couch for a couple of hours my book that I got in Paris, The Charter House of Parma. Um, now I am going to go to dinner, um, wearing this white top, same hands as before. Um, we're going to a little French bistro that's quite famous in Paris. Um, and then a lot of people are going out today because tonight is Halloween, but I'm kind of feeling a more cozy Halloween and I have work tomorrow so I'm just gonna go home after dinner um, and finish some work or finish my book uh, but come to dinner. <laughs> So I'm gonna walk there, work there for a bit. Um, we're gonna have a little team meeting and then after that, I'm gonna go have lunch. Around here actually, like around the Eiffel Tower, um, around the Arc de Triomphe. And it's a really cool sushi restaurant, so I'm gonna take you guys. Uh, and then after that, um, I'll work a little bit. And then I want to go thrift shopping because I haven't been yet and today is a work day so all of them are open so I'm gonna see if I can make this like tight timeline. We'll see but come along. Here's the outfit by the way. I'm wearing this gray vest, gray pants um, and I'm gonna wear the fluffy coat because it's super fucking cold. Good morning. Um, today is really exciting because I have a shoot for work later in the day but before that I am going to check out hello I'm gonna go check out a school in Paris where I'm thinking of applying for masters so it's at La Défense which is a bit far away so I need to take the metro to the last stop um, it's a bit outside of Paris um it's kind of like Canary Wharf in London like that what is with this focus anyway I'm going there now for 11 then I'm coming back to Arc de Triomphe for a shoot and then we'll see if I have time to go thrifting but um, either way, I'm gonna go to Pigat and check into my hotel where I'm staying tonight before leaving. It's called Hotel Amour. Hi guys, I'm back. I am having a little lunch. So, I actually really liked the school that I went to. Wasn't sure if I wanted to go there, uh, so that's why I had to check it out. But I actually really liked it. Uh, campus was great. Really reminded me of my high school in Denmark and had like good vibes. The kids were stylish. Most people were speaking French, so it would actually, you know, help me learn French a lot faster. So shooting was great um, now I think I have time to go to like maybe my top two thrift stores it is dark already though so I'll see um, I might just like go buy a whole cheese and like knock myself out um, but here's the hotel room so you saw you saw the carpet in the hallway Anyway, so much stuff, like, 
look there is like even like this whole shelf of books crazy and like paints and crayons like what and like cameras some things i i love it like what are these books i cannot i can't believe the paints like they have everything and like what this is so crazy mm, yeah here is the bath cute um Oh, I love this. This is such a cute hot Oh, I wanted to stay here for so long. Like, oh my god, their shit is like Barreto. Kill me now. And you don't see, but my view is onto like they're in their little pink courtyard. I swear they made this fucking mirror with like youtubers in mind like what is this is like hello turn on hello like am i right oh and their radio music is so i'm so fucking i don't want to leave like fuck thrifting i'm just gonna stay here forever I did a total 360 um so i went to come on aileen which is like a vintage store on rue de rivoli and it was horrible um like i guess it would have been nice if i was like a shoe size 38 because and if you are go there i don't have a picture of them but i saw these like literally the most amazing um pink chanel heels i've ever seen like they were like 200 euros but i would have bought them like they were literally fucking insane so if you're 38 go there but as if as a shoe size 40 um i didn't find any shoes i didn't find any clothes everything was like super dusty so i didn't particularly like it um but i called my friend and I was like, yeah, I think I'm in your area. Like, instead of going to my hotel, we can just meet here. Because um, it was, like, super spontaneous how I went to the shop. I literally got on the metro. I was there at, like, 7. I had to be back at my hotel at 7.30 to meet, like, friends for dinner. So I was like, well, actually, I'm in your area. And then we met up by in the Marais around the Bastide. Um, at this super cute cafe called Cafe Cosmos uh, and we just had like a cheese night with some friends and wine they had amazing comte um, it was so so cozy and then I got home at like 11 I just had a bath I hate baths I am not a bath person that was so nice I just sat there and I was like I'm in a bathtub in the middle of Paris, in like my favorite area of Paris, in a fucking super cute hotel. And I was so happy, like, damn, Paris, stop. <laughs> At some point, I won't be able to take it. It's too nice. Anyway, now I am just in bed. Um, I'm gonna check in for my flight tomorrow gonna have a little breakfast and go to the airport at 2 tomorrow um so i have no idea how short or long this vlog was but i had so much fun 
in Paris. Um, and that is it for the Paris adventure this month. I will be coming back in December for Christmas Paris. So 